on you to please turn off any cell phones, pagers, beepers, anything that might go off during the performance and disrupt the team, because that would be very rude of you to disrupt them during their performance. All right, team, are you ready? Yeah! yeah! Awesome. Appraisers, are you ready? Yeah! yeah. <laughs> team, you may begin. scientists. My name is Professor Preposterous. At the center of our galaxy resides a supermassive black hole known as Sagittarius A. If you've read the renowned, if you've read the theories of renowned physicist Stephen Hawking, you will realize that mass affects time. For example, if one were to stand near the base of a pyramid, time would be moving slightly slower to that object in accordance to objects that were further away. It's a hard idea to wrap one's head around, I understand. Alas, it is true, though only on an incredibly minimal scale. Now, if we were allowed access to something unthinkably large and dense, we may be entitled to harness that power in order to time travel, so to speak. Okay. This is my space function. Black holes are the densest, most massive singular objects in the universe, they exert so much gravitational force that nothing, not even light, can escape their pull. If one were to orbit the event horizon instead of being sucked in, one could remain there in slow motion while time on Earth moved forward. My newest invention makes this possible. Behold, the gravitational control component, or the GCC, by modifying the behavior of atoms and particle colliders, we have discovered that when their rotation is reversed, it provides the elements necessary in order to balance out gravitational pull, therefore making this experiment possible. Exactly four weeks ago today, we sent three brave astronauts into the far reaches of space. Every staff member has one of these devices to ensure their defenses against spaghettification, as well as a slightly, sl as well as a, as well as a slightly smaller unit for the ship. Upon their return, it may have been years, decades, or even centuries since they last set foot on our planet. It is indeed a risky mission, but for the price of knowledge, we believe our cause is worth it. For in the end, science must move forward. <sighs> this gear is so stuffy and scratchy. Why do we have to wear it? Don't touch that, Cobalt. This gear is keeping your very bodies together. You'd be spaghettified without it, and the ship does the same thing. Not to mention, it has gravitational control components that... Still, couldn't we find anything more comfortable than this? It's comfort to your life, buddy. Use it to lose it. <laughs> I get it, I get it. How long have we been out here, anyway? A month, about. How do you think the Vikings did last season? Oh, well, let's see. For the last 14 seasons, they haven't had a single winning one. <laughs> Are you serious? We've been here for four weeks. That's 14 years on Earth and the Vikings still haven't won a Super Bowl. <laughs> Isn't there anything interesting up here? Oh, you want to see something interesting? Here, let me turn the ship. Dudes, check this out! <laughs> Finally, something interesting! James, you owe me a soda. We don't have any sodas. Back to the black hole, what we came here to study. It truly is amazing. These dudes that look exactly the same from every angle. That's incredible. Do you think we can get any closer? Don't touch that. If we get too close to the event horizon, we're doomed. Zan says stop. Eleanor is right. Don't get so close. What was that? Oh no. Xanthus, what have you done? The generator is going to shut down completely. We need to go down and fix it before the entire system fails. The black hole is warping the hull. 
It's going up the, up the gravitational control component. We're gonna get spaghettified. No way! I don't want to become a delicious Italian entree. <laughs> <laughs> spaghettified means we'll be slowly ripped and stretched apart by the strongest gravitational force in the universe. Nowhere does this include food, cobalt. <laughs> Gravitational control components are not functioning. Several other parts, too. What do I do? What do I do? Got it. I can replace it with these parts for my suit. Meaning my body will be slowly destroyed by the harsh gravity. But still, I have to save my friends. They may be clueless at times, but I've grown close to them. Let's just take this part off. Die, but it was worth it in the end. It gave me the adventure of many lifetimes. Thank you for that. You can't just leave us. I don't regret what I did. Every moment in this voyage is worth a thousand lifetimes. Thank you so much. Eleanor? Eleanor! She's gone. There's nothing we can do but honor her memory. You're right, but without an engineer, we shouldn't risk staying here any longer. Agreed. Let's set course for Earth. For home. Our appraisers are now going to come up and ask you some questions. Audience members, if you need to leave, please do so quietly through those doors. Otherwise, sit quietly in your seats. Okay, wonderful, wonderful job, team. Hey, team. Get here. Oh, sorry. <laughs> hey, we need to find you. 